Hello and welcome back to another beer review. I'm Ben the Beer Lab and today I'm going to be doing a Neon Raptor Seven Island Brewery beer. This is called Severed Island and this is a tiki cocktail sour at 6%. There it is. Picked this up from Market Bottle Shop. Don't know when but just picked it up. Um, yeah, tiki cocktail sour. Should be good. Should be an easy make this. I don't really see how this can go wrong but you know I've had things go wrong so anyway the uh, guff on this one says this collab with greek legends seven islands began in 2018 and we finally brewed it we've concocted a tiki cocktail inspired sour full of sev uh, full of severed fruit slices so chopped up fruit um island spice and some secret magic it's sweet and sour tangy and tantalizing and guaranteed to tickle at least seven senses and then the flavors are meant to be pi uh, pineapple passion fruit cherry cinnamon and nutmeg all that is on there i quite like this can art just a nice gradient color with a island in half it's meant to be a rolled beer i'm just going to give it a quick one um and then hope it doesn't explode when i open it so let's crack it open shall we see what we got These cans have started getting a bit uh, tougher to open now. Harder to crack. Right, let that uh, settle a second. But there's the beer. We have ourselves a nice crimson red beer. Light's not really making that look good. It makes it look a bit murky brown, but it's actually a really nice bright red beer with an off-white, like mild pink compact head. Looks really nice. Let's get a smell and see what we get, shall we? First thing gets cherries, um, cinnamon and nutmeg. They are really, really closely followed. First thing, like I said, cherries, nice punchy tartiness in it. Uh, and then very, very closely followed up with nutmeg and cinnamon. This nice spice smell to it. Pineapple you can get. I'm not getting the passion fruit though. It smells nice. It smells tart, but it also has this sort of Christmas feel to it. Let's get a mouthful for volume car. Carbs quite light. Body's medium. A sour scale. There's a sourness there to it. But instead of it being this big punchy sour that's you know hits you in the face and then disappears really quickly this is a lingering sour it's really tarty in the cheeks it's sort of you know does that sort of sucks the cheeks in <clears throat> um and it lingers it's probably i'd say about a five it is sour but it's not turn your face inside out sour but it's not a beginner sour it's a nice middle middle of the road one but yeah medium body and light carb so far, so good. Let's get a big old taste, shall we? Cheers. That's good. Um, so, first thing I got is the cinnamon and the nutmeg. Actually, the spice flavours first. So, it sets it up as the base flavours of the beer. So, you've got that throughout, and then you're just getting peaks and hits of... Um, fruits, cherries, pineapple, passion fruit is there in the flavour. It's not strong, but it is there. Um, but yeah, you're getting you're getting this nice, savoury, you know, spice flavour as the base, and it's just this nice, not too much of one, not too much of another. It's a nice balance. Um, the fruits aren't too much. They work well with the sour, obviously, because they are sour fruit. That they put in um it's yeah it's it's a nice balance the the spice doesn't make it go too far and too sweet but then the sugars don't go too spice flavored and savory it's just a really nice balance beer it's nice i quite enjoy it neon raptor have made a good um <laughs> pardon me 
the Neon Raptor have made a really good sour here, um, especially a collab one. Um, it's just yeah, it's a good beer. I really enjoy this. Um, I think this is going to get the thumbs up from the missus. I'll pass it over and uh, we'll see if it gets a thumbs up or not. There you go. What do you reckon? Good. <laughs> Pull my face there. Yeah? Thumbs up? Yeah. So, um, I'm not going to go away and enjoy this. Uh, this I no longer have it. That's not my drink now. Um, so, Neon Raptors and Seven Island Brewery. Tiki Cocktail Sour. Uh, Severed Island. Out of 10? I think that's a solid 8 out of 10. It's nice. It's fruity. It's got a nice spice to it. It's just an all-round good beer. Um, this is probably one of them ones where you've had a lot of starter sours, you know, they're really weak and they're really, they don't really kick your face in or anything, and, and this is sort of to move you up a bit and just, just get that next level of sour going, uh, sort of to really experiment with. It's nice. It's, yeah, just a good beer. Uh, so, if you have had this before, please let me know. Let me know what you think, if you like it, if you don't, if you've not had it, I'll leave a link to both. The Unwrapped and Seven Island Brewery down below. Don't know if you can get this. I got it from the Market Bottle Shop, but give it a look at. Just see if you can find one. I recommend it. So it can't be that bad, right? Um, if you like the video, thumbs up, thumbs down. All your usual stuff. If you want to subscribe, consider doing so because the show must go on, etc., etc., so on and so forth. And I'll see you later.